Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For those who are new here, hi, my name's Nicole. I am a thrift store enthusiast. I love to buy pre-owned goods and sell them on eBay. Uh, this video is going to be about our sourcing trip to Stroudsburg, Pennsylvania. Uh, we originally went to Stroudsburg so we can go to uh, the outlets in Tannersville, Pennsylvania. And along the way we stopped at, uh, let's see, where did we go? We went to some flea markets, Salvation Army, some yard sales, really anywhere that was selling some stuff. So uh, let's dig into the haul. I remember seeing a post about these kind of trolls with the funny looking ears. I didn't look this guy up, but he is from 1992. So I hope that he's gonna bring me lots of luck and money. Next up is, it wouldn't be one of my haul videos without a play sound book. This is a Blue's Clues. Of course it needs batteries, but no big deal. Another one of my favorite things are die cut cardboard decorations. These are absolutely adorable and I'll keep them for myself. Another one of my MVPs. How great is this wig? I love it. That's so cool. I would demonstrate it, but I want to mess up my hairdo. I'm channeling my inner gypsy or uh, fortune teller in today's look. This is a size 2X. Uh, anything vintage that is also in bigger sizes does really well. I'm not sure. I think my boyfriend wants to keep this, but it's amazing. It's like a button down jacket and this also we found how cool is that another troll this guy looks like he has some acid wash jeans on at first I thought he was like a uh, playing an aviator with his little scarf but then I saw this acid wash denim I'm always buying replacement pieces. This is for the Doc McStuffins um, vet check. But we, um, one of the local resellers in my area, she gave me one of the vet checkups. So I'm actually going to put that, and I have some other replacement pieces as well, and put them together. And um, I'll, I don't think that I'll list it locally since she gave it to me. My son's actually playing around with it, so. It'll probably linger around for a little bit, and then when I'm sick of picking up the pieces or sick of seeing it, I'll probably uh, list it on eBay. This definitely reminds me of my childhood. I had one of these, and I freaking love it. Unfortunately, it's missing um, a piece. I think it had like a feather or something come out of it, but uh, it says 1988 Fisher Price. This went around the neck. This is like a drum carrier, and it, it, it's missing the instruments. When I actually, when I picked this up, the pieces were all scattered about the two that were there. So I'm sure maybe when it was donated, it had more pieces to it. But over time, um, you know, the pieces just got lost. But um, I have some instruments. I'm just gonna. I'm probably gonna keep that for myself, but I can just use whatever pieces I have. I love new old stock. I didn't pay ten dollars but um, this is from 1999. Also new old stock Lisa Frank. This is a... oh no it's new. I thought it was older. Darn. It doesn't have the year on it but it says like us on Facebook. Follow, follow us on Twitter and Pinterest. So that would lead me to believe that it's new. Darn. It has crayons, pencils, a brush, sharpener, 
a mixing tray. That's okay, I'm sure some Lisa Frank lover will love to have this in his or her collection. Look at this. I found this in a dollar pile. It is new old stock with the original Ames tag on it. Honestly, I hate to say that I'm going to keep it, but I absolutely love it. I don't know. We'll see. I can't say that I'm going to keep everything because my house will get filled with so much junk. I'm trying to move out stuff, not keep bringing stuff in, you know? Ah, look at how cool this is. Home Improvement Tim Allen set. New in the box. It's probably missing the plastic covering, but who cares? Has a tape measure, flashlight, some gloves, and the hard hat. These are definitely 90s platform foam sandals. I wish they were my size because I would definitely rock these this summer with some bright colored toes uh, popping out at the end. Oh, I just sold one of these actually the other day. An Elmo electronic guitar. While we're on the, the theme of Sesame Street, here is a car, steering wheel, and some other buttons. I've been loving picking up this stuff for myself. I, I paid up for it a little bit, $3 a piece, but I have the Santa, but now I have another set. I want to make one of a kind uh, wreaths. This will look perfect on my wreath with some glass balls. Or on, I have a, a silver tinsel tree. That would look cool on there as well. What do you guys think of my Cinderella Little People set? Isn't it cool? If I can get this bag open, Jesus. So I'm collecting all kind of vintage Christmas ornaments and decorations because I will be making my own wreaths to hang up and also to sell. Maybe I'll tell you guys the story some other time about the wreath fiasco. All right. These are so cool. They're like half ornaments with little people inside. One. These are so cool. Wise men, nativity people. Here's Mary, Jesus, and Joseph. Little soldier boy. More nativity scene. Ah! More soldiers. Soldiers. Okay. I found two of these. New old stock Barbie. Um, let's see. Kid Care. It has a comb, a brush, and some tissues. A collectible. Love to have this on like a makeup vanity holding their makeup brushes or just as display. Little coconut purse. I thought this would be cool around Christmas time. Or not Christmas. Around Halloween or anywhere, anytime. 